So up next, we're gonna show an OA self-mobilization that a patient can perform. And just to review that OA pretty much does nodding exclusively. So we're gonna use the wall as feedback so that we can localize the motion to the upper cervical spine and only get the nodding from there versus allowing full cervical flexion. So I'm gonna be up against the wall. My heels are touching, my glutes are touching, my back and the back of my head are all touching the wall. And when I'm actually doing the mobilization, I'm thinking about drawing an imaginary line with my eyes. So I'm looking across the room and I'm gonna draw a line down the wall and across the floor with my eyes. And I'm just spinning my head on the back of the wall. So my head is staying in contact the entire time. My, the rest of my body is as well. And that means the motion is only going to be at the upper part of the cervical spine. So again, I'm here all the way down. Then I can also add overpressure with this hand. So the, the pressure I'm giving with this hand is a little bit um, caudal and a little bit posterior to keep the arc of the motion that we want in that nodding position here. So again, everything's touching, tracing that imaginary line, and then overpressure. So that's an upper cervical OA nodding self-mobilization.